hi in the last video I have shown you how you can execute sample flight booking application from HP and we basically automated the execution now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use parameterized execution and going to make use of this data table and then I'm going to insert values to the date with the help of global data table sheet before that I want you to see what we are actually doing in this program as you can see it is taking refilled value which is 11 11 14 that I'm going to edit and going to give you a custom value and it should be taken from this data sheet so in order to do that you have to open key keyboard view and then select mask ad box for date and there you'll find this configure box then you have to select parameter radio button then select data table and keyboard input and then click on ok right now what we have is 11 11 14 you can change that to 11 12 14 12 12 14 so these are my three values now what I'm going to do is I'm going to execute my test now and I'm going to see if application breaks Now as you can see there seems to be a wrong value in second and third where QTP is going to call error but before that we'll take a look at test we'll see where exactly is the error when we are doing parameterized execution you have to check expert view and then you have to make sure that each instance of flight application is open with the help of system util dot run and inside that you have to give path for application in our case this part is from here just copy and paste it and then go to automation click on record and run settings click on windows application then go for the checkbox that says record and test on any open window based application click on apply then click on ok after that edit your input
now we will execute again as you can see it has also taken second date and also the third one all three tests are passed so the thing here is you have to edit the application path copy the path here and give it to your first statement the reason behind that is whenever we are doing more than one execution of same application it expects QTP expects that the same application is already open so in order to avoid that what we are doing is we are running the test again and giving it the path which QTP ignores when it uses parameterized execution and when usually it uses the path from record and run settings it only use, use that path once so what I have done is I have given the path explicitly that's all for now and I suggest you to perform this test on your own and see how you can work with it make sure you do this whenever you see error while running parameterized execution also make sure that you are entering a valid input here otherwise that will also give another error so I will see you in next video with another topic in QTP bye